Welcome back. It is Thursday, so that means author Ali is here. Ali, good afternoon. I'm so excited that you're back today. I'm so excited to be here too, Taylor. And so this today's book, a library book for bear. Go ahead and tell us about this. So this week's kill it pick of the week is a library book for bear. And it's by Bonnie Becker and illustrated by Katie McDonald Denton. This is a really funny book about bear and mouse. So it's a series and this is one of the books in the series. Mm -hmm. So mouse wants to take bear to the library, but bear does not want to go. He is grumpy and he is not having it. So after some convincing, he attends the library with mouse. And Mouse tries really hard to find him a book. So oh. he finds a book about canoes and pickles <laughs> and trains. And look, he is just He's just not, not having it. <laughs> no, no. So as he's trying to convince Bear that there's a book for him, Bear overhears a librarian reading a story time to all of the other little animals. Aww. And so he's just so intrigued by this. And that moment he discovers his love for the library and how libraries are so magical because we have librarians who read stories and share it yeah. and just foster the imagination. And it's, it's so funny because during the entire book, Mouse and Bear are almost fighting the entire time. <laughs> Mouse is trying to keep Bear quiet, and at the end, I don't know if you can see this, but Bear then, <laughs> yells at other people to be quiet because he's trying to listen to the story time. Oh, that's so funny to see that role reversal, and I think this is so true, especially for little kids. I know uh, growing up, I always didn't think the library was a cool place to be, but once I learned what it was, it was amazing, and I think this is a great little uh, story for our young readers. Why do you think this is so important? It's so important because, you know, we can find ourselves in these characters. So some of us are like Bear, and we can be grouchy and grumpy, and sometimes we don't want to go somewhere, whether it's work or school or the library. And sometimes we're like Mouse, where we have to really kind of strong arm our friends to do stuff and to get out of their shell. And so, you know, we can find ourselves in these characters and see how they – how they kind of morph themselves into being like better versions of themselves. I love this. And Allie, really quickly before we go, what age group do you think that this book is best for? It's great for ages three to seven. The watercolor illustrations will them. captivate any reader. I love them. I want to turn through the pages myself. Allie, another wonderful book as always. Thank you so much for sharing it with us today. Thank you, Taylor. All right, guys, if you want to learn more about Bear and his library experience, head to our website, KLAF.com. But before we go to break, let's check in with meteorologist Adam Olivier.